All right, guys, I need your help with this. I want you to go ahead and take the cards and uh, just just give them a good mix. Okay. Oh, what's that? You're not here and you can't mix them? Well, you know what? I've I've taken the liberty of, of mixing them for you. So the cards are already mixed, as you can see. Uh, so I've saved you something, but I will need your help. I will need you to uh, to go ahead and mix them face up, face down. So if you can go ahead and do that right now. Oh, <laughs> I, keep, I keep forgetting that you're not here. So I, I've done that for you as well. I've mixed them face up, uh, face down, just like, just like so. All right, thank you for that, by the way. It's very, it's very kind of you. Um, Actually, one more thing. Could you, could you think of this card, and could you go ahead and make every card the same? Let's see how you did. Well, not half bad. Let's get into today's video. Uh, and we're rolling. What's up, guys? Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to try and solve a very special puzzle. Any fans of Star Wars out there? But I was going into Toshi Station to pick up some power converters. This is a level eight burr puzzle known as the droid. As some of you may know, burr puzzles are probably my most difficult and challenging puzzles to date that I've ever tried. Uh, this puzzle is made by Pelican Puzzles by Steven Baumiger. To solve this charming puzzle, there is no force required. The force is what gives the Jedi his power. The rich and iconic twist to your traditional take apart and put back together puzzle. This puzzle consists of eight different pieces and requires 35 moves to free the first piece. It's crafted in Europe with absolutely fantastic quality. Every piece of the puzzle is precisely cut and very well made. You cannot find its equal anywhere else. Total of 49 moves. So it's 35 moves for the first one, two moves, then two moves, then three moves, then three moves, then three moves, then, three moves, then one. As cool as this puzzle looks, I'm definitely not looking forward to it. Enough of that. Let's get into solving this droid puzzle. Beep, boop, boop, beep. All right, ladies and gents. This is a little robot, you know, kind of like a little R2-D2. By the way, if you guys hear any noise like this, that is uh, construction and renovations going on in my house, please ignore, let's proceed. All right, so uh, let's see what moves and what doesn't. Okay, that moves. Okay, and that moves. So we're here, got you. How about, oh, here we go, okay. Oh, interesting, okay. Oh, his little leggy popped out. One of his little, not a leg. <laughs> Poor guy, he's all, he's getting all disassembled. And probably won't get reassembled, just letting you guys know that. This is one of those puzzles where reassembling it's gonna be a pain in the butt. Oh, hello. Hello, that came straight out. Oh, wow, can we get that out anymore? That's blocking it. These guys are blocking it here. Oh, weird, he can like almost rotate. We don't want that. Let's get this back up. <clears throat> Have a look inside here, see what we can figure out. Oh, that's new. That's also new. Hmm. You're gonna need to get this piece out because it blocks this one. So this piece has got to come out first. Uh-oh, this one rotates. No, that's not good, is it? This puzzle doesn't really matter, it's kind of equal on every side. Unlike the, uh, what was that other puzzle? The Thor. Okay, I got this one out to that. So that's good, I think. We're making, we're shimming our way up to the top here. Through the bottom. Like every burr puzzle, this is uh, super complicated. 
Don't get tilted, Chris. Don't get tilted. Let your mind and your hands come together. Figure this out using your intuition. Seems to be stuck. Everything seems to be stuck right now. I feel like I'm going back to the beginning here. Oops, what's going on here? I feel like I'm going back to the beginning, which may be part of my plan. <laughs> it really isn't. It's getting kind of rough to play with because the pieces I see, uh, I think, are swelling. That seems like progress. Well, we've been in this position before. Can you go through there? Doesn't look like it, not yet. Not yet, sir. I do not bite my thumb at thee, sir, but I do, sir, bite my thumb. I don't know where that came from. Romeo and Juliet. Yes. To go down here. And somehow I'm back to the beginning. <sighs> that's 40 minutes of my life. That's uh that's about all I can take for this sitting. So. Alright. Well, that didn't go according to plan. Not that it ever does. I took a break from that puzzle, but I, I had a notion, and actually a notion, this is suggested by you guys. One of you suggested a couple videos ago that why not send the puzzle that I can't complete to someone who could complete it and have a fan do it. And I think that's a great idea. So instead of busting my butt on trying to solve this puzzle, I'm gonna challenge one of you guys to bust your butts on this puzzle. Comment below, I'm gonna choose one of the commenters. Uh, ideally, first of all, you need to have a little bit of a camera set up, whether that's your iPhone, that's fine, but you're gonna have to film it because I'll feature it if you solve it. And then I need you to be familiar with burr puzzles. So comment below if you're familiar with burr puzzles, if you have a camera set up, and if you feel like attempting this puzzle. Obviously, if you don't get it, We'll send it off to the next person and keep it going until someone solves it. And by solving it, I mean not only taking it apart, but also putting it back together. So let's start a bit of a challenge right now. That being said, I do feel like solving a puzzle today. So uh, I'm going to introduce something a little simpler. We are going to try and solve the Ring Road Metal Interlocking Puzzle. There are three interlocked pieces in this puzzle. A couple moves required to take it apart. Uh, putting it back together is probably going to be more difficult once again. But I feel like understanding these simpler puzzles will help me eventually understand the more complex burr puzzles. So let's start there. Let's get into solving this puzzle and hopefully uh, we can do that. All right, something a little bit simpler to stroke my ego. Warning not suitable for children under three years due to small parts, which could rep represent a choking hazard. Listen, if your kid's eating this, you're doing it right. All right, that's it. Cool little tin can comes with. I guess that's the solution. Not gonna look at it. We're gonna leave it right there. Boom, boom. That looks right. Boom, boom. Yep. So far so good, we're almost out, yep. This is, was way too easy. Boom. Rotate, baby, let's go. Out here. And one. And done. Boosh! That's actually great. I know that that's probably the easy part. <laughs> let's, uh, I have no idea what the hell I'm doing at this point, so let's try to... There's probably more than one way to put this back together, I'll be honest. If not, then... Help me. All right. Hey, did it again. Nice. Two for two. But it has something to do with this. I really probably should have paid attention on how I first undid it. Ugh. There's got to be like two this way and then one this way, right? And then one this way. They rotated. Rotating kills me. Yeah, I guess taking them apart isn't that hard. Hmm. Nope. Yeah, this is not going to be easy, ladies and gentlemen. Well, that might be it. Is 
Oh my god! Get wrecked. Get wrecked, Ramsey. Jesus is difficult. Hold on just one second. Hold on. Hold the phone just a minute. Did I get it? Almost. Okay, not there. Not quite, but getting there. Oh, that has to be on the other side. Okay. Can I take this out and rotate it? Or is that too late? Oh no. I'm honestly so close. This piece is backwards. But how do I? How do I? Get your booty on the floor tonight, make my day. Cause now I'm like interlocked again, like I have to solve the puzzle again, just to rotate that piece. I don't even know what the hell I did. Just let me turn it. Just let me turn it. Stop. Stop it. Stop. I am so close right now. That's it. That's... And we go again. And we go again. Be nice if I could just kind of... Up here, that's good. Oh! oh, we got it. Look how pretty that is. You're going back into your box where I never want to see you again. Ah, oh, done. Well, you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, one loss and one win on today's puzzle making. That was actually fun. The second one was a little bit more, a little bit more fun because I saw some progress. Uh, we got it apart quite easy. Putting it back together was actually quite difficult. It did require me to rack my brain a little bit and I feel like I lucked out. Uh, I wouldn't want to attempt it again, but that being said, I did solve it. I'm quite happy with that. So guys, thanks for watching this video. Remember to comment below uh, if you are interested in solving the spirit puzzle, if you have a camera set up and a little bit of puzzle knowledge, I will happily send this to one of you guys on the house uh, for you to solve and to be possibly featured on this channel. Thanks for watching, smash like and uh, subscribe. We'll see you on the next video. Peace.